Did you do much storytelling when you were in school? Yes, I think so, because, you know, I used to like to do essays for people. We did essays and short stories for homework, and I would do everyone's essays for them if they'd do my math, because I wasn't very good at math, and I could always write a good story. So I would just uh, pass around the stories, hand them out, and, and um, I was pretty popular for that. They'd say, that crazy girl will do your stories for you. But you have to do her math. You have to do her math, yes. Tell me a little bit about what the Shanachi was. The Shanachi was the storyteller in olden days in Ireland who would come around the villages and come into the cottages and tell stories around the fire. And when the Shanachi would come, they would say, he's coming, he's coming, and they would bank up the turf fire and everybody would gather around and the storyteller would come in with his story and there would be lots of tea going on the hearth. And the Shanachi was a really important figure in, in the old days in Ireland. And would you have been a Shanachi if you could have been? I think I would have been. I'm not sure if they had women Shanachis. I only remember hearing of men Shanachis, but, but I would certainly have been a village storyteller if I'd been born in those days.